and welcome to Yiki Now with Melly Mel. I'm Melissa. Today I have another Disney merch haul. These are items that I picked up at my local Disney store outlet. This was in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. Stay tuned. Alrighty guys, so as you might know, the Disney stores are just gone. However, there are still some Disney store outlets out there. And in Pennsylvania, in Lancaster, Pennsylvania, they have a Disney store outlet. It is not like Character Warehouse, but kind of similar. There you can find items are highly discounted. Mainly things are from previous seasons, but also some things are sold at the parks for regular price. So I am so excited that we were able to go there and get some really good deals. So the first thing I'm going to show you is this really cute hoodie. This is part of the vault collection. It's like this classic Disney look. Now this is still at the parks and how cool is this? It does say um, Disney World on the hood part of this hoodie, right? And it is so cool. Now this right here, it kind of feels like a rug. Um, has this like, uh, I don't know how to explain it, <laughs> like a rug type of feel here. So it looks really cool. Now I don't know what the regular price was for this. I'm gonna see if the ticket actually says so. Okay, so this was regularly $59.99, but it was on sale for $34.98. So almost 50% off. This is a really, really nice hoodie. And again, this is still at the park. So if you're able to make it to the outlet, it's a great deal. And let's continue with our haul. Now, you might be wondering why this is <laughs> just wrapped in tissue paper. Well, at this store, they do not have plastic bags, so you either have to bring your own tote or buy a tote, right? Or just carry your items. So, for what I'm about to show you, I asked the cast member to please give me tissue so it's easier to keep together. We have a bunch of pins, right? Because what is a trip to the outlet without getting some pins, right? So I'm going to start with the bigger ones right here. These are part of the Disney Mickey Mouse, the main attraction. Now, when these pins were first released, I want to say they were around $24.99 to $30 regular price. However, these were $2.98 a piece. Now, these pins are limited release. Here we have Dumbo and here we have Peter Pan's Flight. So I am going to show you close-ups so you can see these really cute pins. Now, Peter Pan's flight was number six in the series of 12, and this one was number eight. So these pins are definitely a great buy. I mean, you get a great deal. I mean, $2.98 a piece, but they were almost $30 each. Again, I want to say it was in between $24.99 to $30, the retail price for these pins. They are limited release. They're a good size. Um, they're pin on pin. They have some glitter elements. So 
these are definitely great pins and while i don't collect uh mickey and i did not collect mickey mouse the main attraction these will make for great traders actually later on this year disney should be announcing their annual pin event this should be in epcot so pins like this would make great traders to bring to an event like that because you get to not just trade with cast members but of course you get to trade with other guests and this could be part of like your pin trading portfolio so these again are a really good deal for what they are these pins that i picked up here are also a great deal these are part of the ultimate princess collection the disney designer collection pins so from the Disney Designer Collection, we also had, of course, the dolls, right, which were very expensive, and the accompanying pins. Now, the pins were a separate purchase. I believe the pins were $29.99, um, so they were very expensive. But again, just $2.98 for these pins. These are also limited release. Now, I basically bought the whole set on sale because, again, these are great traders i mean this is not a bad trader by any means these are really pretty pins these are pins that you know you get to open um they come in like a really nice backer card these have information on the different designers that participated for this series so again these are really pretty pins i'm going to show you closest in just a second i actually did not have bell i had been wanting bell because again beauty and the beast is my main pin collection i know i've said that before but i was kind of waiting for this to happen right for these pins to actually go on sale to finally get my bell pin so i got two bell pins because of course one is going to be for me the other one is going to be to trade but let me show you close-ups of this great deal As you might have noticed uh, in the close-ups, I mean, these are really nicely made pins, which I can see why these were on the pricier side. These are very well designed. When you open it, it says the name of the princess right here, in this case, Belle. On the back, it has an autograph of the designer. On the inside, again, you have like a little biography. And uh, the elements on these pins are just really pretty. I mean, for example, Belle has a lot of pearlescent effect on the design. So really, really pretty pin. And again, it's still $2.98. So I'm going to go ahead and show you all the other pins that I got from the Disney Designer Collection. I'm going to show them to you all together. Um, here we have Snow White. Here we have, well, the extra bell. <laughs> here we have, I believe this is Cinderella. And here we have what looks like either Aurora. I think it is Aurora. Uh, no, let me see. This is Tangled. Okay, so Cinderella, Beauty and Beauty and the Beast, uh, Snow White. No, this is actually uh, Rapunzel because it has a little sun at the bottom. You see the design of the Disney Designer Collections. Um, the designs were unique, <laughs> so they were very different from what the princess actually looked like. Um, so this was like the artist take on like a modern version of the princess so this one is supposed to be um oh my goodness rapunzel from tangled and then here we have moana again all these pins were around 30 dollars when they first came out 2.98 at the outlet now i'm going to show them to you all together so you can see how pretty these pins are
Alrighty guys, so now we are going to move on to the big ticket item. This is a displayable item. This is something that came out in November of 2022. So this came out last year, like less than six months ago. And this is something that you can currently find at Memento Mori at Magic Kingdom, which is the Haunted Mansion store. So yes, this is another Haunted Mansion displayable item. I recently showed something that we splurged on that was Haunted Mansion related. If you haven't seen that, I'm going to link it right here so you can see what I'm talking about. So we got this really cool piece that again is pretty new, still at the parks. And we got it for a steal. So I'm going to open this real quick. And again, I am so excited to see this in person because again we picked this up at the outlet yesterday and as you can see this was still sealed i haven't opened it yet i have my trusty scissors right here so i'm going to open this carefully this okay so i'm still taking this out of the packaging but this is a brand new Madame Leota lamp that again just came out in uh, November 2022. The retail price for this at the park, if I'm not mistaken, is $125. But we just got it at the outlet for $54.98. They also, by the way, <laughs> they also give you military discount at least at the Disney Store outlet in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. So if you are a military family, ask for your military discount, they'll give you 10%. So we got all this plus 10% off uh, for the military discount, but oh my goodness, this is so cool. And it looks like the batteries are included. Let's see what kind of batteries these are. Three AAA batteries. So I'm going to take this out so that we can see this in action. So when you take the tag off, you see that these lights, that kind of look like LED lights, are on now. And this is really heavy, by the way. Beautifully made. This Madame Leota looks amazing. But look at this. So cool. I'm going to turn off the lights so you guys can get a better look. Wow, this piece is amazing. It is so well made. Again, it's really heavy duty. It's a beautiful piece of decoration. And I love that Madame Leota's floating head uh, can technically be displayed on its own if you wanted to or by itself. So beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And I cannot believe it's at the outlet for $54.98 when it's really at the price for $125. Um, but that's it, you guys. That was my Disney merch haul from the Disney Store outlet in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. Let me know in the comments down below which item was your favorite. As usual, if you love the things that I talk about, definitely subscribe, comment, like, and hit that notification bell so that you can keep waking out with me.